here we are. We finally made it. The 2019-20 school year is over. And none of us could have ever imagined that this is the way it would have ended back in August when all those smiling faces first came into the buildings. When we left school on Friday, March 13th, many of us thought this would be a much needed two week break. We could unwind, we could calm the nerves of many people who were very scared for obvious reasons. And little did we know that this would be the last time that we would see any of our students or set foot in our buildings or our classrooms for the rest of the year. In a matter of two short weeks, you have helped to dramatically transform the district from doing the only thing we ever knew how to do into this new virtual unknown world of caring for our students, for our families and our community. Teachers, I can't thank you enough for all you have done to really keep connecting with your students, whether it was through Zoom or birthday parades or showing up in driveways to draw in chalk and just let students know that you still care about them. You have cared for not only their academic needs, but also their mental needs and their needs just as human beings. And it's not just our teachers, it was our secretaries who were the front lines answering the phones and trying to let parents know what was going on. Our custodians who worked hard to clean and sanitize our buildings not knowing when anyone would come back. It was our principals, our administrators who did everything they could to support our staff, to support our families, and to keep things normal. It was Nikki at Backpack Pals who every week filled hundreds of bags of food to give out to our community for our students in need. Our food service workers who were on the front line, literally on the front line, risking their own safety for themselves and their families to provide meals to our students who we know needed it. And for that, I can't say thank you enough. On behalf of the entire board, everything you have done has truly been remarkable to move us forward. Now, as we begin to unwind and we take some time off, uh, I would be remiss if I didn't thank a few extra people, Dr. Roy and Dr. Silva, who have worked around the clock to keep things moving forward, to keep everybody online and to give direction and guidance when it was needed most. And certainly to Mrs. Bachman, our chief technology officer, who without her and her team, none of this would have been possible. Handing out hotspots, Chromebooks, wireless devices, anything needed, supporting the IT needs of family throughout all this. So Mrs. Bachman and your team, thank you so much for all you have done. And now, as we do begin to unwind and we prepare for summer in a much needed break, it's really important to remember that while for us, this is a much needed downtime, for many of our students and families, this is a scary time. We've had parents who have lost their jobs, their businesses, they've worked their entire lives to build or at risk, and many have had their hours cut back, which may have other circumstances like losing healthcare and things like that that we take for granted. So while for us, this is a time to relax, please reach out to your students, reach out to your families, that you know may be in trouble. Just with a simple hello, be kind this summer, do everything you can to support them, to check in, because we certainly look forward to seeing everybody this fall when hopefully we can get back to normal, we can get our hair cut, uh, and we can do all those things that we have given up these past few weeks and months to keep everyone safe. So thank you for all you've done on behalf of the board, on behalf of everybody, and most on behalf of the students and families. Thank you for everything you've done and continue to do. Have a great summer, be safe, be kind and have some well-deserved time off.